Oh, Calvin is dead. But what now? There is no way to revive him. And last time you saved us several days ago. Is he gone forever? Or is there another way to get him back? Like in Pet Cemetery? Well guys, there is a solution. But first I recommend creating a second save game in case any errors occur. Your next step is opening the app data folder. Just type it in the search bar and press enter. Go to the path and click app data once more. And in the folder called local low, you can find end night. Open that and navigate to sons of the forest. Then saves, this long number and single player. What you see right here are all your save games. If you wanna be extra careful, just create a backup for them. Let us go into the most recent folder while we search for a file called Game State Save Data. Open it with your notepad and locate Is Robbie Dead? People are assuming that's Kellen's first name. Change true to false and save. Great, we're nearly done. Close the file and scroll down until you see Save Data. After opening, you can press Ctrl and F for the search function and then type quotation mark type id backslash quotation mark colon 9. Press enter and there you go. Now find this part where it says state. Just change the 6 to a 2 and just one or two lines below is his health. Whatever is written here, you need to change it to 100.0. Save once more and let's start up the game again. Remember to load the younger save and if you're ready, just open your GPS and track down the K symbol. It should be the place where Calvin died, which in my case was our base. And Calvin is back. Oh my God, I missed him a lot. He definitely deserves a break. Take good care of him now, okay guys? But if he dies again, you know where to find this tutorial. If you're having trouble making it work, check out the video description or leave a comment so I can help you. My name is Trepo and I hope you enjoyed this guide. If you want to see more Sons of the Forest, then just go ahead and subscribe.